Good morning, everyone. Thank you for starting the day out with me. I'm Jenna Stauffer. I'm going to start things off today by talking with another Fantasy Fest royalty hopeful. Joining me this morning is King candidate Shane Hall. Now, Shane's campaign is all about bringing an awakening to the fact that HIV and AIDS is still very much alive. He wants to serve as an ambassador of change for the face of AIDS in our community. Shane, it is a pleasure having you here. Thank you. For well, thank you for me. having me. I appreciate that. All right, Shane, before we get into your campaign, I understand that you kind of have the same Key West story that a lot of people have, and that's that you left everything up in the north, moved down here, took a leap of faith, and here you are. Yeah, a little bit. I um, actually left it in the west on, on my part. Uh, moved over here from Dallas. Been coming back and forth to the Keys for about 20 years. Fell in love with it a long time ago and always dreamed about what it was going to be like to live at the end of the road. And um, started making that transition about five years ago. And then three years ago, the company that I was working with out of California decided that, that uh, the economy was a great way for them to change as well. So I stepped out of their reign and decided, okay, I'm going to take a leap of faith. And you did and it. And I did it, and here I am. Here you are. And how is the end of the road treating you so far, Shane? Fantastic. <laughs> Best time of the year is coming up, winter. Okay, so. that's right. Right, when it's <laughs> warm here always. Yeah. Now, yeah. Shane, how is your run for Fantasy Fest King going thus far? So far, so good. Uh, people were very responsive. Um, I think they're excited this year about the campaign coming from everybody. Um, I'm excited. I really got geared up this past Saturday with my kickoff to my calendar, uh, mm -hmm. which was great. We started at zero Duval, made our way all the way to the end. It took us eight and a half hours, um, mm -hmm. but it was fun. I, I hooked up with Q Mitch on that one, and we had a fantastic time. Great. And now, Shane, I really like your campaign. As I mentioned, this isn't just about winning a crown for you. This is about really bringing about some change here to the community. And I, and I love that, that you want to do that. Absolutely. Um, <clears throat> I'm very concerned about uh, the youth that's coming up and they have no concept really of what AIDS and HIV is all about. Um, I'm concerned about the complacency that um, we as, a, as adults have come into contact with when it comes to AIDS. Um, we seem to be a mentality of uh, it's not a disease, that it's a death threat anymore. Yes, we are living longer with it, um, but individuals are now battling different struggles that have come along. After 20 years of medication, they're now dealing with um, complications of heart disease, kidney disease, liver failure, um, dementia. Um, so I'm really concerned about th that complacency that's there and the stigma that still exists with mm -hmm. the disease itself. Mm -hmm. So you, again, if, if you were to win King, you want to be an ambassador of change, kind of be the face that can, that can change that mm -hmm. stigma that, that unfortunately is still around. Absolutely. I'm hoping that this is going to be uh, a way to become a voice, um, mm -hmm. an awakening voice is what I'm kind of saying. Um, to, to what AIDS looks like today as opposed to what it looked like 25, 30 years ago. Mm -hmm. And of course, you're very passionate about the organization AIDS Help. Absolutely. Um, AIDS Help is a great organization. As we know, uh, they've been around for many years, do m a lot of good for the community. Um, but I'd love to be uh, a face of change, not only for what AIDS looks like today, but for what that organization is doing today. They're having to change what they are doing in order to meet the new needs of, of the community and encountering what the disease is itself. And I would love to be that voice for them. Um, I don't think that this community has a strong voice for what the face of AIDS looks like today. Mm -hmm. I think we have a, a strong voice from AIDS help in ways to combat the problems that come up with it. Um, but I don't think that we have a great face out there for what it looks like to the community itself. Great. Well, we're going to be talking actually later on on the show with one of the directors from AIDS Help, so I'm excited. We'll learn a little bit more about that organization. But Shane, let's talk about your run. I mean, you are going to be dedicating now the next two months of your mm -hmm. life to this campaign. Yes. Are you ready for it? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, 
I guess if uh, waking up in the middle of the night and thinking about it and in the morning it's the first thing that you do is something with it and in the middle of the day while you're trying to work, you then I'm ready for it. So, <laughs> you're ready. Yeah, I'm and ready to go. You've got your bucket. I do. Right? I have my, this. this is my, called my stash can. If instead you, of trash can. my trash can. Cute. Yeah, I'm <laughs> my, doing a play this year on uh, the, the mustache and the beard. It's kind of an identity for me and people who know me in the community, it's always, they know me with a beard. So kind of took off with that and we've kind of run with it. Um, so my stash can is all about collecting funds while I get what we're doing out there uh, to the community. Mm -hmm. I love it. Now, you've always had a, a beard or a sash since you've been in Cuba. I think I was born with it. You so. were born with <laughs> it. Yeah, I love yeah, it. Yeah. Right as a newborn, you had yeah, that. Yeah, I think I did. I just, I, I really, unless I look back in old <laughs> photos, I don't remember myself without a beard or a mustache or something. So. Okay, well, don't get rid yeah. of it then anytime <laughs> soon. All right. Well, there is, uh, maybe. Oh, really? Yes. I'm looking for a sponsor out there um, to match. Um, a raising of ten thousand dollars if I have somebody that will match that uh, ten thousand then I will um, shave at the end of the campaign Wow okay yeah. so you will wait until the campaign yeah. is done yeah. well I hope you get that because you know it would be interesting to see what you look like without it but <laughs> <laughs> all right Jay, and what do you have coming up that people need to know about oh uh, um, I have a, some great fantastic events coming up uh, on the 15th of September we're doing um, a return to Sorted Lives, the movie. Uh, an hour before it, I'm reenacting uh, the funeral itself for Sister. If you're familiar with the movie, it's all about, about uh, White Trash America, which is hysterical. Uh, all the characters are coming. I actually have the casket and uh, Sisters in the casket. And we have fried, chickens and fried chicken and uh, uh, smoking rubber band snaps. And it's all <laughs> part of the movie. It'll be fun. Uh, and then I have a great throwback to the monster and the copa coming up which everybody is very excited about and the orioles we're bringing it back for one night only at uh the oriole downtown from eight till however we go you know into the morning great that's gonna be great bringing back old bartenders uh some of the performers the drag queens the lights the smoke the confetti the whole nine yards great. and then we're going to get a little sophisticated towards the end okay we're going to go to uh the gardens hotel for um, a return to the Gatsby. Mm -hmm. It's going to be the play on the 20s. Uh, have some live singers coming. Uh, they're doing some jazz numbers. Great food. Great, amazing silent auction that we're putting into place. And um, hopefully, if everything works out, we have a group of gangsters that will show up in the middle of the, uh, middle of the event to take over. So. <laughs> Sounds like you're not going to be having any fun at all, Shane. No, 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 no. No, <laughs> no yeah. you, you have a lot of great stuff planned. And, of course, if anybody wants to donate to Shane's campaign, just check out the information that you see on the bottom of the screen. Shane, thank you for being on with me this morning, and good luck. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Check out my website check out my reasons for running. Mm -hmm. This is all about changing what the face of AIDS looks like and bringing it back to the media. Great. All right. I'm going to be talking with some more candidates here in the next couple of weeks, so be sure to tune into the show. I'll be right back after these messages.